Now show us some sexy poses there. <laughs> Everything you pose is sexy. Yes. She was Work born it. like this. Yes. yes. Beautiful. Oh, <laughs> grab it. Lick it. Yes. Flick it. Do I have to look at the camera or you? Yeah, this You mean story. like not everyone know who I am? <laughs> I'm Doris. Uh, I'm doing pole since 11 years. Uh, so for those who don't know me, I'm mostly uh, on the sexy part of the pole. Even I love everything about pole and mostly stripper style. That's really my jam since I was a stripper before. And make everyone feel comfortable with the body and express their sensuality and make fun of it. I'm from Paris, in France. And how is it to be a businesswoman and have your own studio and run like a big studio in Paris and travel all around the world at the same time? Uh, it's messy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I try my best. Uh, I, I am I'm having an incredible team in Paris. Uh, so I'm the owner, but I have an office manager, I have a manager, I have a receptionist team, uh, I have a team of teachers, so everyone is doing an incredible job. Uh, they used to have me on travel, some of them even travel as well. So I think we find a nice routine and balance when I'm leaving. Uh, we have social media and everything, so we can still communicate. Uh, airports are amazing to work in. <laughs> So it's, it's kind of difficult to find a balance, to, to train, try to be a good performer, keep doing progress, uh, stay creative, but at the same time, on, owning a studio, that means like uh, be the administrative part of work, also be the boss and manage your team and everything, so, and also have a personal life at the same time. Uh, because I'm a poor dinosaur, <laughs> as you, Julia, just no, no. When, yeah, that's true. When I start, there is not that much stuff, and I think it was a good opportunity to just, for me, be who I wanted to be. Because if you start another type of dance, like classic, like ballet dancing, ballet dancing is exists since like a lot of time. So everything is already right down. So you have to do this type of move, this type of. Uh, position, there is a real strong codification, so you are not free. You either love it and train for it, or either leave it. And but ball, like there is nothing. There is just this ball at the beginning, like just something going from the floor to the ceiling, circulate different sides, and that's it. So you can basically train on it and do whatever you want. And so I see the opportunity to be free and create my own style. And because I come from striptease, but I also come from dance, and I love everything is who is. Uh, that is that is uh, acrobatic and stuff. I uh, saw so the opportunity to mix all of this. What is sexy for me is when you express your sensuality or your sexuality. So there is not a specific kind of aesthetic. So sexy, you have to learn it. It's not like some people think there is like a code, genetic code, like sexy woman, not sexy woman, you know, and you have to belong to one on one. I don't think so. I think it's a language and everyone have to learn this language. Like, like it's like on theater. If you want to express something on stage, uh, you can't be and just jump on stage and express it. You have to learn how to do it. No, just enjoy, like, no matter what kind of pole you like to do, just enjoy it, be proud of your body and take your time on everything because, as I said, I'm doing pole since 11 years and I always learn this lesson. Like, I want to do something, but my body takes a lot of time. Never judge, like, for your strength, for your sexiness, for your flexibility. Never judge yourself and never judge other people, like, if you watch, for me, if you watch other pole dancer, um, if you watch them and try to see the beauty inside, it's going to help you to find your own beauty and feel good about yourself and your style.